Hey guys, so today I want to talk about IKEA. For those of you who don't know what IKEA is, IKEA is a Dutch store with Swedish heritage and it's a really big store in Europe and um, they do have some stores here and it's just really cool. It's just this awesome like European store with all these like weird tchotchke stuff and a lot of good home like furnishings and stuff like that and kitchen stuff and really like almost ridiculously good prices and I've just been not obsessed but I've been really wanting to go for like years because all my friends have gone and said how cool it is but you know the problem was we were like three hours away from the nearest Ikea store at our old house so I just never was able to go but now here we're only about an hour 20 30 minutes away so that was kind of doable just amazing and I just wanted to make a video to show you guys what I got and tell you about it and so that's what I wanted to do today. So the first thing I did before we even went to the store is I went online and I joined the IKEA family. It's kind of backwards here but this is a rewards program. It's like you know your Walgreens card or you know speedy rewards but this is pretty legit. And I only, like, I suggest doing it before you go to the store because even if you think you're going to only go once, you know, why, you know, join, it is definitely worth it. And it's a lot faster if you join before you go instead of trying to type in all your information on this, like, little, like, touchscreen kiosk thing they have in the front of the store. And it's just really easy. And there's just so many benefits to have not having the card, you know, belonging to the IKEA family. Like the first trip you go to Ikea, you get like a free ice cream cone. And every time you go to Ikea, you get like a free coffee or tea. And you also get discounts on certain items and everything. And I just thought it was cool. So I joined. And um, like you join online. And then when you go there for the first time, you can pick up your card. And there's another one too that you can like put on your key ring. But mine's on my key ring, so I'm not going to show you. Um, so this is like the big card that you get. And I just think it was really great and I was able to get some money off of some of the stuff I bought because, you know, I'm a part of the IKEA family. So I definitely recommend joining it. Even if you're going to just go once, you're probably going to benefit from it anyway just from your first trip. So definitely recommend that. And then, then you get to the store. So from what I understand, all the stores are built the same, so pretty much... The store that I went to is going to be the same as the store that you go to. And it is just huge. Like, they literally have to give out maps. There's like three floors. And this is like octagon shaped building. Everything's on. And mostly everything is on like the second floor and kind of on the third floor. And it's just, it's huge. And, like, you literally just have to, like, take this map and use it as you go. Because I got, I'm not going to lie, I got lost, like, once or twice. Because it was just, like, everything's everywhere. And it's just kind of overwhelming at first. But also, like, they also have their, your, their own little process of how to... We have prepared the IKEA store for you to shop on your own and like all these steps and everything for you to shop and they've got a like little list that you can write down stuff. Um, like if, you, if you're buying furniture, like their process is you like find what you like on their like showroom floors and then you go down to the first floor where you also check out um, and you pick up the boxes there. Like, they have everything, like, methodically placed and processed. It's, like, incredible. And it's, like, awesome, too. And another big and awesome thing about Ikea is that they have, like, their own restaurant there. And this food is good. And it's also really good prices. And, like, that's why I really just wanted to, like, spend hours there. Because it was just amazing. But I only had, like, an hour to shop because it was, like, a, like a quick trip. First quick trip in. But it was just incredible to see how many things they had, and it was great. And so that's kind of my little, like, rant, like, advice giving on going to Ikea for the first time. Because it really is incredible. And honestly, it is so big that it, if you're like me and only had a certain amount of time to shop, definitely use their shopping list thing that they have um, on their website. Also, if you have a smartphone, like a majority of us at this point 
I think do. They do have a IKEA app. Yeah, IKEA app. I'll find it. Oh, there it is. And it just has different things. You can look on the products on there. And also, I want to show you the shopping list. Because you can have, just have a list. And it will actually tell you where it's located and how much product they have. Like, one of the things I got was a lamp. And it, showed me, it tells me that there are 40 in stock. And it is located wait I don't know a couple I'm not mean that this item but there's a couple places like I'll tell you like it's in like in the kitchen aisle or whatever and so I just thought that was really cool and it helps you know make everything more efficient and even if you don't have like a certain time that you'd be out at least you know what you're getting so then you can just kind of relax a little bit and I thought that was good and so yeah I guess now I'll just show you guys what I got. So first off, this is the bag, and I got a lot of stuff. Um, they do sell these blue bags for 59 cents each, and I think they're really worth it because they don't have, like, it's kind of like all these where you have to buy bags or bring your own bags. So buy these for 59 cents, and they're huge and well worth it, and I think they're just a great price. So I got one to carry everything I got. And I also have my receipt, so I can tell you the names and the prices of everything, just in case you see something you like. And so the first thing I got was the... I'm also going to butcher these Swedish names of everything, just so you know. Um, first thing I got was the Jal um, standing um, laundry bag. There's like a picture of it up here. And I really like it because it's really nice and thin and portable and light that I can just stick it anywhere um, when it's not being used in my dorm room. And that was $4.99. And the second thing I got was my comforter. And this is the spring corn comforter. And what was really cool about this was because I was a member of IKEA family, um, I was able to get a really good discount on this. Like it's usually twenty dollars, and IKEA family members um, got it for ten dollars. So I was able to I was able to get ten dollars off of this, and it was really awesome because I really liked this, but I didn't want to spend twenty dollars on it when I was looking online. And but when I went in, it was you know oh yay ten dollars off. So it was really cool, and it's really great. Like a, even without a cover, you know it has color, so that's kind of cool. And the way IKEA does their comforters is they do them by levels, like one being like the coolest, um, kind of thin, and then like three or four being like the warmest and thickest. And this is a one, and and I think that's perfectly fine for a dorm. You know, I'm not going to be experiencing really cold winters or anything like that. And this is kind of like the same like thickness or thinness as my old comforter um, last year, so. I'm not too concerned about being cold or warm or anything or too hot. And so yeah, it's pretty cool. It's twin size. And the third thing I got to go along with my comforter is my duvet cover. And this is Lapple Jung. It's twin. It's got some really great colors like the picture doesn't do it justice, so I'll have to show you guys again when I open it up and get it ready for school. But I just really like the pattern and the colors. I just think it's great. And this was... How much was this? Um, this was $29. It was $30. So it was kind of more one of the more expensive ones because usually they range from like... Ten dollars to up to like I think seventy dollars. So this was kind of like the mid-range price, I guess. But I just love it; it's awesome. And I also got a fleece blanket, and this is Linby. I just really like the zigzag, almost chevron type pattern of it. And this was on sale, like on the website. I think it says like ten dollars, but at the store. 
I got it for, um, I think it was like $5 or something. Or I don't know. But it was really great. And um, it's really soft. And I just love the pattern. It's like just super awesome. Really cute. And another one I got was just like a picture frame. It was only a dollar. And I, it went... <laughs> I just think it's really cute. It'll hold a picture of me and my family, maybe, or something. And, you know, just for a dollar, I thought it would be really cool. And it does complement my comforter, so even better. And this lovely thing. Oh, this is Tollsby, and I got it for a dollar. And this is Compliment. It's Basically, um, it's not a good picture of it, but it's basically like a scarf holder or something small like that that you just put in your closet and it, organize it organizes it and it keeps it from falling off a hanger or something like that. And this was $7.99. And I just think it's great because I have a lot of scarves because I really like scarves, especially during the winter and stuff. And so this will be... A Cute place to hang them all, hang them, hang them all up in. Can't talk today. And next thing I got was the Jan's Low um, LED clamp light, um, and I got that because at my at my new school, we're. I got this because at my new school, I want to be able to have something to like light up my homework or something if I'm working at night and my, or my roommates are sleeping because I will have three roommates, two or three roommates at my new school and I'm pretty sure I'll be up past any of them doing homework or something like that. So just to make sure that I can be able to work and clamp it on my bed and just keep working. And it's really cute and it's LED so it's more efficient and everything else and I got it in white. And this was how much was this? This was fifteen dollars. And almost lastly, I got the Brada laptop support, and it's basically like a lap desk, like it has two legs and it folds out and it's like sits there and you can put your laptop on there or like me homework or something and I really wanted to get something like this because past year at school I always I didn't have one of these and I always was wanting one because you know my laptop would get really warm on my lap or I would want to just like sit in bed and write or something and I would have to like use a notebook or something and I just really wanted something like this, and I thought it was just really cute. It doesn't really go with my bedding. Like, I don't really have a theme um, like I did last year. So, and that's okay, because I just think it's really cute, and I kind of just like what I like. And so this was, how much was this? This was, this was $10. I think this is a really good price because this is made out of wood. It's a pretty good price. And then lastly, it's kind of like a random little tchotchke item. I got a timer, and this was $2. And I just think it's really cute because, well, A, like if I'm cooking at school, just, you know, wind it up and timer. Or, like, honestly, for, like, study sessions, if you're, like, doing timed reading or timed study, just, you know, crank it up to like 10, 20 minutes, whatever you're doing. And and then, you know, voila, you have, you know, a study timer. So I thought that was really cool. And so, yeah, that's what I got at Ikea. And I just had a really good time. And if you like this video, please hit like and subscribe. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope everyone has a wonderful rest of their day. Bye.